The way we define customer experience at Sprint is we want to go where the customer wants us to be. So um, we want to be able to delight them in um, any manner in um, wherever they choose to do business with us, whether it be in the retail store, whether it be in um, our call centers, whether it be online in the web, or whether it be on their device. We want to give them a seamless experience that uh, gives them the value that you know they believe that uh, they're paying for out of us. So our new CEO, um, uh, he when he started in early 2008, um, his number one priority was improving and transforming the customer experience. Before each of the channels, online, web, retail, third party, care, collections, telesales, they attempted to locally optimize themselves so that they could offer the best kind of possible solution in their channel. But the cross-channel global optimization was really never even considered. So we brought on ClickVox and some other partners, and that's one of the things we really started looking at is upstream in these other channels, why are customers getting dissatisfied with us and why are they calling? Because truly, they really only call us when they're dissatisfied. They don't call us to tell us we're doing a great job. And then downstream, once we get the call, how do we handle that call the first time and um, prevent a callback and satisfy that customer on the first call. So that is fairly revolutionary in my opinion um, in terms of thinking about the whole ecosystem of how you run a customer service shop um, and applying a tool like this that you already have all this cross-channel data on. You already know what the customer satisfaction is. You already know what the first contact resolution is. You already know if they end up churning and then applying it back to your internal processes so you can tune them in a very lean kind of Six Sigma fashion. using. Good scientific data analysis is the only way to drive customer satisfaction up while driving your operational costs down. Because um, if you're not using a tool like ClickBox, you're just using whatever gut feel you have. And if you have a large shop, that gut feel is going to be wrong probably a majority of the time. If you look from, from then till now, uh, there, the ACSI, the American Customer Satisfaction Institute, just released its latest uh, set of uh, customer satisfaction results. And Sprint had leapt from 2007, last place, to the 2011 results first quarter, number one in the industry. Unprecedented, had never happened before. Uh, if you look at Nielsen, again, went from last place to tied with uh, number one, and in some cases solely leading number one. Hundreds of millions of dollars um, have been saved with this, and it's in the public domain that the overall budget for call centers at Sprint is half today what it was back in 2008. And we went from last place that time to first place in almost every other major customer satisfaction surveys. The thing that I love about ClickFox is they came in and understood what our business challenges are and helped us create solutions to, to better our business. So like many other vendors that I, I do business with, they wait for me to define what my problem is and what I think a good solution is, and they try to you know, help me with that solution. ClickFox um, had a team here on site back in 2005, looking through our data, trying to help us uh, figure out what those true uh, business problems were helping us Pareto them out. These are the big opportunities, these are the lower opportunities. You know, let's focus on the big opportunities and really helped us transform this business. So um, I look back at the, you know, the key partners. There's only probably three key partners that helped me uh, in that transformation I talked about, especially on the IVR uh, customer satisfaction and containment link. And ClickFox um, is you know, one of the uh, two companies, uh, two partners I would say that helped transform that. And we wouldn't have been able to do it without the insights that ClickFox gave us. So I just want to talk a little bit about ClickFox as a company, my experiences over the last really six years. Um, I do business with a lot of suppliers in the customer service technology space. And one of the things I truly appreciate about ClickFox is their willingness to dive in and help me solve my business problems. And not do it, you know, waiting for, you know, a consulting dollar. Not doing it, you know, contingent on a deal, but just because you know, they truly want to do the right thing. ClickFox wants to come in and they believe, uh, which I believe as well, if they can help me better my business, that's going to reward them in the end. Out of the 20 other major suppliers I have, there's only one or two that I would put uh, in that quadrant of ease to do business with and really, I feel, care about my success and the success of my company. It needs to start at the top and you need to focus on upstream and downstream as part of what you consider your customer service issues. And upstream are things that are done in um, the rest of the business that 
would end up generating a call into your customer service centers. And generally speaking, customers are not happy because when they have to call a center. Um, they want to buy whatever they're, they're purchasing from your company and they want to use it and never really have to contact you about it unless they want an enhancement or an upgrade. So anytime they have to call, you've automatically upset them. So go, go figure out upstream what's causing those customers to call, those reasons, and do a root cause analysis and implement an irreversible corrective action, just you know, Street Six Sigma stuff. And I think that is probably you know, the most important thing to do.